Hello guys, welcome to another video. Today we are replacing some parts in my duster. It's not a joyful video, so to speak, because I have to take some money out of my pockets and make some repairs. Initially, I didn't want to replace the wheel bearings. I only wanted to replace the steering column heads or something like this I don't know the English word these parts are not that expensive we talk about uh, 20 euros each after uh, careful considerations and seeing how the wheels are on my duster the front wheels they are very loosened and I have to replace the bearings it's not okay to solve only the half of the problem. That being said, let's start the replacement process. out that this uh, simple uh, wheel bearing replacement is quite an adventure because we had some problems with a uh, part which was definitely not expected in my case it seems that the ABS sensor is uh, stuck in its place near the wheel bearing and you have to take it out in order to remove the old wheel bearing and replace it with the new one. In our case, we lost about an hour trying to remove the ABS sensor without breaking it. It was obvious that we cannot take it out without breaking it and we decided to remove it, also replace the sensor and the only way you can do this is by getting it drilled with a uh, with a drilling machine so this is how the rest of the sensor looks like we got it out right now i'm going to order some new sensors because the other wheel has the same problem fortunately they don't cost that much they are around uh, 14 15 euros each that's it for now i will come back at the end of the video and talk about the full repair costs with this wheel bearing replacement <laughs>
to replace the wheel bearings you have to take out the ABS you have to take out those two sensors and if you are unlucky as I was uh, and they got stuck the only way to solve the problem is to break them throw it away and buy a, a new set this unexpected uh, issue costed me an extra 30, 30 euros it's not that much unfortunately we lost a lot of time trying to get the old sensors out which uh, made the repair uh, last uh, two days I mean we had to leave it uh, one night and come back the other uh, evening and uh, finish up the work yesterday I got time to head over to a garage that uh, makes the wheels geometry that also costed me around uh, 40 euros and the overall costs of this replacement was uh, around uh, 280 euros yes the wheel bearings and the steering uh, rod ends were around uh, 160 euros the rest was the ABS sensors car geometry and the labor for this replacement at the beginning I wasn't quite sure if the bearings had to be replaced in the end I uh, thought it through and it was better for me and for the next owner if I replaced the wheel bearings as well because with just the replacement of the steering rod ends in about one year the wheel bearings should, uh, should have been replaced and they could also damage the new steering uh, rod ends and the next uh, owner should also have had to do the car geometry indeed without the wheel bearings replacement the total cost would have been half of the final cost but with this replacement I I'm going uh, off-roading and I'm driving the car on the roads with uh, less worries in my mind what do you think the wheel bearing replacement was a good idea or not leave a comment below with your thoughts that's it for today guys thank you for watching thank you for supporting me don't forget to subscribe leave a like and even a share if you think this video is a helpful information for other uh, people thanks again and see you in my next video